Good morning, good morning, good morning everyone and welcome to Sami's Distance Learning. In this video, I'll be giving you guide and important information regarding the topic in Science 3 for the fourth quarter. I will be sending your activities and assignment in your Pearson account so it's better to log in and check it out every day. The topic is about scientists. And what questions do scientists ask? Before we continue, I want you to prepare your science book, notebook, and pencil until the end of this video to take note and mark important words that will help you understand the lesson. As for your references, we have the following. Your integrated science book from page 298 to 301. The YouTube video from Science for Kids Read Aloud. And of course, your Pearson activities. Let's proceed, girls. To start with, let me show you pictures. Try to guess if you know them. Ready? First picture. Who is he? Think, girls. Second picture. Do you know him? And last picture. Now who can guess his name? Who do you think they are? If your answer is scientist, then bravo, you are correct. They are some of the most famous scientists around the world. Here are their names. And let us know some facts about them. First, Sir Isaac Newton. He was an English mathematician, physicist, and scientist. He is widely regarded as one of the most influential scientists of all time, developing new laws of mechanics, gravity, and laws of motion. The second person is Galileo Galilei. An Italian astronomer, scientist, and philosopher who played a leading role in the scientific revolution. He improved the telescope and made many significant discoveries in astronomy. Lastly, Louis Pasteur. He was a French chemist and microbiologist who developed antidotes and cured to many dangerous illnesses. He also successfully invented a way to pasteurize milk and make it safe from tuberculosis. Well, thanks for him, we can drink safe fresh milk today. How about you girls? Do you know any scientist? As for your activity, in your notebook, list down at least two scientists that you know and introduce them to your mom and dad. Do you, you can do this even after this video. Don't forget to discuss and share it with your mom and dad. Now, who wants to be a scientist someday? If you want to be a scientist someday, then do the scientist clock. The rhythm goes like this. Ready? One, two, one, two, three. One, two, three, four, I want. One, two, one, two, three, one, two, three, four, to be. One, two, one, two, three, one, two, three, four, scientists. This time with clap. Ready? One, two, one, two, three, one, two, three, four, I want. One, two, one, two, three, one, two, three, four, to be. One, two, one, two, three, one, two, three, four, scientists. And now, this time without counting. Ready, girls? And go! I want to be scientists. Very good, girls. Now, try to repeat this as many as you can. And I think you might want to be a scientist someday. Who knows, right? Everyone can be a scientist. Before answering the next question, using your highlighter or any markers, 
underline in your book the important information that will appear in this video. Ready? What is a scientist? Can you guess the correct answer by looking at the pictures? If your answer is a person, then you are right. Clap, 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 clap. Scientist is a person who asks questions about natural world. Again, scientist is a person who asks questions about natural world. Can you repeat the word scientist? Scientist. Say it again, girls. Scientist. And what question do they ask? Here are some questions that scientists might ask. What type of soil works best to grow corn and soybeans? What makes us human? Why do we dream? How do we get more energy from the sun? How do we beat bacteria? How do we beat virus? What is at the bottom of an ocean? And can we live forever? Scientists collect observations in an organized way to investigate their questions. To investigate means to look for an answer. Let's repeat the word investigate. Investigate. Say it again, girls. Investigate. To investigate means to look for an answer, and then scientists explain their answer. Everyone can be a scientist. You are a scientist when you ask questions and investigate. How about you, girls? What questions do you ask about the natural world? Science begins with inquiry. What is inquiry? Inquiry means the process of asking questions. Can you repeat the word inquiry? Inquiry. Say it again. Inquiry. Scientists ask questions that they can investigate. The questions might come from something scientists observed or a problem they know. But some questions cannot be answered by investigating. Science cannot answer questions about personal opinion. Sometimes, scientists work alone. But sometimes, scientists can learn more by working together. When scientists work together, they can share more and more and more information and discoveries. For more information about famous scientists, click the YouTube link below. Make sure you have your notebook and pen with you to take notes, the names and informations that will give you additional reference. Check this out, girls. Well, I hope you get some information that will help you to finish your activity that I gave you a while ago. And again, share it with your mom and dad. To end this topic, let me give you some spelling words to practice and study at home. Write this in your notebook. Ready? The words are the following. Scientist. Investigate, inquiry, question, answer. Again, scientist, investigate, inquiry, question, answer. Don't forget to write the words in your notebook and practice to spell the words. 
Check your Pearson account and WhatsApp for more update, announcement, and exercises. I'll be uploading this video to my YouTube channel so don't forget to subscribe, like, and click the notification bell to update you for more videos. Remember, we have many videos to come. Abiento girls! Goodbye and see you in the next video.